I told you about the toilet bowl thing, right? What toilet bowl thing? <laughs> you know we're recording, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> Is there a snake in the toilet bowl? No, I told you when I was young in Costa Car, like way back when, you had those hand phones, like not cell phones, but mine reached to the bathroom. And I said to my girlfriend on the uh, phone, and there goes my voice again. Um, I'm like, wouldn't it be hysterical if you could actually move around? And what if you saw me like in the bathroom? Oh, yeah. And then here we are in 2018. I think that is the right year. Yeah. Um, just. Yeah, it's like the future. Uh, We're in the future. We're, it's like Star Trek. But yeah, and, and the Jetsons, like those mobile whatever they try to do. But I thought of it, and here we are today, and that is what's happening. Yep, we could see each other on the phones, or on the computer, yeah. or on TV. It's Don't cool. you find that trippy? Yeah, it's pretty cool. I used to think I would enjoy it so much more, but now it's like, eh. Now it's like, who owns a house phone? Yeah. Mine isn't even hooked up. All right, well, go. What are we doing? All right, so we're talking about, I was going to give you an update on Stern. So you don't listen to Stern too much anymore? never have <laughs> um, when I was dating a guy in LA would put on Stern when Stern was younger on 50 now so this is like 25 years ago uh, yeah no not when I was born so I'm going to retract that little bit of a statement but when I was about 25 26 um, no I'm going to have to read Stop, re-record. Okay. That was my brain. I'm 50, but this is when... No, I got married when I was 23. So 24, 25, 26. So 27 years ago. Like 27. Yeah. Oh my God. Don't make me think. It's fine. So, no, so you... Did you like him back then? When I was about 27, I was dating this guy couldn't get a divorce and he always listened to Howard Stern and when Howard was younger there was a lot more of a betrayal of him with you know boobs and the bottom part and like have these bikini contests yeah and so forth and I would put on Bruce Springsteen I'm like I don't listen to this uh -huh. that was ridiculous I thought and still today but as i met him it's not all about that um yeah. and became part of the family i think he's the one of the run of the nicest men i have met he's always been kind and great to me but it gets a little boring and i have to say this to talk about no i'm gonna say a fresh word pussy tits butt fucks so <laughs> I think that just needs to be declined. They need more tan mom. More tan mom always works. <laughs>